first edition was really exciting. People had a lot of um, really good ideas, new things to do together. In our workshop, we came up with three sort of flagship ideas, getting cells to work with machines, um, getting transplants to work better. And I think um, today we'll get even more of those great ideas for how we can combine technique and medicine and fundamental biology and um, uh, machine learning, all kinds of things. So uh, what I really hope to get out of our collaboration is that we uh, learn better how to implement technology in such a way that it's easy to use for patients and easy to use for doctors. Because we, I think, have some ideas on medical uh, ways to improve the lifestyle of people. Uh, but we really need the technology and the industrial design ideas to bring the technology to the people and to make it work in real life. And uh, I have a cardio lab and as part of that I really would like to create a digital twin of cardiovascular diseases, not only to kind of guide the clinician to give better treatment, but also to give uh, uh, people lifestyle advices. So we are seeing how we can kind of detect the whole health continuum and make a transition from hospital to the home in order to give uh, a better life. There's such an enthusiasm uh, at uh, the medical side. I, I speak with a lot of doctors, department heads, but also uh, people that just started their PhD. And they all realize that in order to address these pressing challenges in the healthcare system, they need technology. So there's such an excitement there. On the other hand, on the technology side in TU Delft, there's so much potential in the technology. And we need the bridge and we need the interaction between the end user, the data, the clinical problems. So the enthusiasm is everywhere. And, and still here, we're only uh, having a few hundred people but I think it's it's a more than a thousand people that's already very enthusiastic about this initiative so the way in which it's growing is quite uh, nice to see quite proud of what's happening I'm giving, calling this a superhero perspective on what you are hoping to achieve as part of the convergence I think it's important that what you've achieved, it's important to get that out to the rest of the world and the rest of the academic community, which I think the convergence gives an excellent opportunity for you to do, for people to learn about what other people are doing and go, I didn't know they were doing that. I asked him to, to draw the experimental setup, which is a biomechanic lab, uh, of, of uh, motion capture together with a dual beam fluoroscopy setup that enables us to uh, uh, study and to see the actual cartilage load into three dimensions. We're talking about a, a new way of imaging uh, the knee in order to more specifically and more precisely diagnose the origin of the, of the pain and the wear in the cartilage of the knee. So I asked for input from everybody who is here. What do you think of the way that we want to finance the next step? And I already, a lot of people say, well, maybe you should tune this in another direction or maybe you should do it like that. And that was the kind of conversation we were yeah, initiating. Um, I think the most important thing is that we did a pitch uh, regarding an, uh, a smart knife. So if we encounter nerves that we don't want to damage or we want to cut around tumor instead of through tumor, that the knife warns us. And we called it the magic wand. And when I talk to all the people here and the help they have and your ideas, I think that the magic wand might exist. Artificial intelligence, know-how. We always have a lack of that in the, in the clinic. Because especially in biomedical imaging, there is uh, a lot that we could do and never enough people who have the skills and the knowledge to do it. Getting together is very important and uh, getting into contact with the medical doctors to learn more about their, their challenges. I mean, not only from the actual intervention that they do, but also how they feel, what, what is the limitation and what, what kind of support we could deliver. So I think that's uh, the, the most important thing. It doesn't matter whether you're from Rotterdam or Delft, you're from both, by the way. But that doesn't matter. We are a team and together we are going to make this happen. So, thank you very much for being here. See you next time. <laughs> Cheers.